What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of our streamers cheaters. Today we are looking into a Facebook gaming streamer who has been caught hiding their cheats. Their name is Mapachon. This guy has got 10,000 followers on Facebook gaming. He streams daily and he doesn't show his hacks on stream but it is extremely noticeable. Before we get started, let me say, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up so we can reach 500 likes. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, at BadBoyBeeman. This is the best way to contact me if you have any information on a streamer who you believe is sus. Right, let's get to it. This is his Facebook gaming page. He already has the supporter button. As we've already mentioned, he's got over 10,000 people who follow him. Let's have a look at the about section. 10,708 people follow him. Obviously, it's all, in, it's all in Spanish, so I don't understand any of what actually is being said on here. Page transparency. The page was created on the 26th of April 2020 and since then he's managed to gain a massive following of 10,000 people and I say massive because there are people out there who've been streaming on Facebook gaming for two three years and still haven't managed to hit 10,000 followers but this guy is cheating and bearing in mind we have actually only looked at his Call of Duty Warzone footage for all I know he could have been cheating on the Call of Duty mobile app. He could have been cheating on other games that he's been playing as well. But we've not actually looked into that. Maybe there'll be another video in that. But for now, let's go and take a look at his Call of Duty Warzone best moments. <laughs> so first of all, what we're going to do, we're going to look through some of the moments where I believe he is locking onto the enemies. And then we'll probably follow up with some of his amazing gameplay after that as well. And by that, I mean every single time he dies. Every last piece of the footage that we have used in today's video is only from today's stream. In this first clip, you'll see that his aim is absolutely awful. However, once he manages to get it onto the enemy, it completely locks on and he does not miss a bullet. Watch. Yeah, let me go by, uh, yeah, Doesn't miss a bullet. But that bad. <laughs> He's that bad, even with cheats. As right, he can't kill an enemy very fast. You see him locking onto the enemy there. This is a fun one. Checking his heartbeat from that distance, no one shows up. It locks on through the roof. If you watch in slow motion, it'll snap. See that final snap at the end there. And then the enemy pops up and his aim follows up with him. And it's still shooting him through the wall now. And what you'll know is that with aimbot, if a wall or an item, object, things like that are bangable, so you can wall bang through them, your aim will lock onto the enemy through them. But this guy is just locking onto everyone. An MP5 with the VLK scope on, and he's locking onto people. He's that bad as well. Even with aimbot, he's managing to miss shots. Watch this one now. This is one of my favourite moments. So at that point, you actually see his teammates put a marker down on that location. So he's using his aim to try and wait for it to lock onto the enemy so he knows exactly where he is. And he pops a couple of shots. And then he obviously remembers, oh shit, I'm live here. I can't be doing that. And then turns to go away. You can tell by the way in which he's missing bullets after the enemy's down that he doesn't have it set to shoot at downed enemies. It's only locking onto enemies who are alive. And that is one of the settings of engine owning. I'm going to put my money on the fact that he's using engine owning software in this. Keeping in mind as well, guys, he's using XSplit Broadcaster 2, which is the one that's actually promoted on the engine owning forums to so actually hide your wall hacks. This is a clear example of his aim locking now. Second shot actually looks legit, even though it's not. But if you watch this one now, 
you see it lock there and then he pops his shots off as you can see that one looks legitimate another one where it locks on a guy coming in locked on to him That clip was just a clear example of how awful his aim is, even with aimbots, because in the gulag, he's spraying left and right, hoping to God that his aim locks onto the enemy. Eventually it does, but he had no control over his aim whatsoever himself. It was waiting for the aimbot just to lock on. That's all he was bothered about. And he still has the audacity to brag about it. Shut up, you melon. This is how I know that he's using the XSplit broadcast. It popped up as he was editing something to do with his webcam, and it says xsplit.com forward slash vcam there at the bottom. And that's where his camera is. Obviously, he was doing something with his green screen settings, and that's popped up. So that is how we know he was using the XSplit broadcaster for this stream. And bear in mind as well, guys, that a lot of these next clips that we're going to see now are whilst he's got aimbot turned on, and he is still dying to absolute bots. He's dying to campers. He's getting absolutely shat on. <laughs> How bad have you got to be? be this bad with aimbot well i'm gonna show you guys now exactly how bad he is these are his stats his call of duty warzone stats he's got 11 wins he's actually played 1045 matches and he's got 11 wins are you listening to me 11 wins his overall kd ratio is 0.82 Okay, so you might be thinking now, how is this guy using aimbot? 11 wins, 0.82 KD. Well, watch this, right? If you go on to modes, right? 96 matches played in the last seven days, and his overall KD ratio for their matches is 2.88. On quads, it's 3.56. Duos, 2.48. And trios, 3.05. Solos 4.12. Okay, so the guy has only recently started using cheats, I believe. Let's have a look at his matches now. Let's have a look at his match history. This is a guy who is using cheats. This was today during today's stream 50th, 27th, 98th, 57th, 12th, 27th, 31st. <laughs> All right, shall we? Keep scrolling down and see how long ago it was he got his last win. Oh my God. There we go. I was on a research in trios as well, which is what? Uh, the new Alcatraz, isn't it? Oh, well. His last win was like two days ago. To be fair, it's not that bad. He got two wins that day. But you can... Clearly tell that as of late, he's started to get a hell of a lot better at the game. I'm sure if you went back and compared it to his old gameplay, you'd find that, you know, he was an absolute bot back then. And he's still a bot now, but he's just a bot with aimbot. So at this point, I decided I'm going to go in his chat. He's live. I'm going to say, I hope you speak English. I know you are using wall hacks and aimbot. I'm going to expose you to the world. You are fraudulently taking donations from people whilst playing with in-game cheats. You are a pure example of what gaming isn't about. I hope Facebook eventually remove your page. I posted that, and this is his reaction to that.
Cosi, Cosi. Que, que espera que Facebook me, me, me cierre la página. ¡Manco! Llega y me dice, espero que hables inglés. Dice, uso hacks y, y que espera que Facebook me, 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 me cierre la, la, la página. Oye, no me... Si, si, si usara hacks, <ríe> si usara hacks, estuviera un nivel más cabrón. To me, that whole reaction at the end, although I don't understand much of what he said, it screamed guilty. You can see him clearly snapping onto people throughout all the clips we've seen, so there's not much else to really cover on this guy. Hopefully, Facebook managed to implement rules and we can get this guy reported. He's one of the big issues. He's one of the ones who's hiding his hacks, trying to pretend to be good and still actually being absolutely awful. Well, there we have it, guys. Mapachon has been caught 100% using aimbot and possibly using wall hacks as well. The guy is an absolute bot. This just shows that actually some people need hacks because even with them, he keeps dying. Even with them, he doesn't get any wins. The guy is awful at the game. Unfortunately, he's managed to actually gain a following of over 10,000 people and how any of them haven't called him out by this point, I don't know. But we've caught you out, Mapachon, and you deserve to be banned off Facebook Gaming and from the game as well. If you've enjoyed the video, guys, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Remember, we're trying to reach 500 likes on this video. Also, drop a comment below and let me know what you think about this guy's amazing aim. <laughs> And if you're new, subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any future videos. We are only just getting started in 2021 and we're going to be dropping some big, big videos very soon. And remember guys, follow me on Twitter at BadBoyBeeman. It's the best way to get in touch with me if you believe you've seen a streamer who is using cheats. Until next time, I'll catch you on the flip side. Puh, puh, puh. Peace!